Woof, woof. Daniel and his furry friend are benefiting from this reading program. It's called C-Spot Read, and it makes reading out loud a good experience. Whether it's being more comfortable. At school, I am very shy, but here I notice that I'm not very shy. Having non-judgmental listeners. Sometimes I mess up and they won't um, judge me. Making improvements. Before I wasn't really good, but now I am really good. Or getting some positive reinforcement. <laughs> Along with learning new words, these dogs clearly enjoy the company. They just just want to be with the child, you know, and the child picks up on that. They, they sense that the dog just wants to be with them. But these aren't just any dogs. They're volunteer therapy dogs from St. John Ambulance, and they've gone through some intense training to be here. Uh, a group of children come into the room and they run around and make lots of noise and they run towards her, uh, they stomp their feet, and it's basically to see how uh, Mika reacts. St. John Ambulance and the Winnipeg Public Library work with the Winnipeg Humane Society to make this initiative happen. You know, I'm hoping maybe you can come Initially, for the first few years, we only had programs through the Humane Society, and then, um, then others, like I said, other schools would then say, you know, we'd like to be part of it too, but we know we can't get there. So then um, we approached some libraries and said, would you like to be part of this? And they were really in interested. Wow, eh? Oh, that one. <laughs> I really, when they first asked me six years ago to be part of the program, I had, I, I couldn't conceive that in 10 weeks a child's whole reading ability would, and self-esteem would skyrocket just because of a dog. But <laughs> I was wrong. It's awesome. It's amazing to watch. C-Spot Read is increasing reading levels by up to three grades. To learn more about the program, you can email education at winnipeghumanesociety.ca. Interning for Shaw TV, I'm Graham Coleman.